Now, last year in JCPS, we had 9,000 children fail their vision screenings, and only about 10% of those had any follow-up. Now, thanks to some help from the Adar's Charitable Foundation, the district is partnering with local optometrist and Vision Works to help fix that issue. On Monday and Tuesday, students at McFerrin Elementary School received vision screenings and a free pair of glasses if needed. I think we screened 300 students yesterday. We found 50 students who need glasses, so that's about 17 percent. Students come in, go through a series of tests, and the ones who need glasses get to pick out a pair on the spot. Dr. Grant Rubish, the owner of Vision Works in Kentucky, says his team is working to get students their glasses within a day. One of our uh, lab technicians, Jesse Carpenter, was cutting lenses last night until 2.30 in the morning. So we're, uh, our plan is to get these as fast as we possibly can. And then so the part that's so crazy is I can't believe they brought the glasses back. So I was thinking, okay, well, I wonder where are they going, where do I pick it up from or whatever. So that part was like just an extra bonus. This group of third graders got their screenings on Monday and were able to pick up their glasses on Tuesday. When I didn't have my glasses, I, I have to go up to the board where my teacher told me to read something. It made me sad because without glasses, I was like different than everybody else. Now, all three students say they can see clearly and have a newfound sense of confidence in the classroom. Thank you. And thank you so much for the glasses. I, need I appreciate them. it. We can do all sorts of learning interventions, but the truth is if they can't see, they're not going to do well in school. JCPS says McFerrin is just the pilot elementary school for this program. They plan on expanding it to all JCPS elementary schools within the next year. From the Algonquin neighborhood, I'm Addie Miners, WLKY News.